Hey guys, Jazz Apps here, and today I'm going to show you how to make an intro on Motion 5, the new Apple software, well not new anymore, but uh, a great Apple software, uh, part of the Final Cut Pro X group. So we're going to open uh, up Motion 5. Oh, phone. So yeah, this is basically what's going to happen is it's going to open up. You're getting to the main page. Here you want to click Compositions. Don't worry about any of the stuff on the right or the time code, the frame rate and all that rubbish. Just click on the compositions or pick any of the subtitles below that. So atmospheric, pulse, um, snap, splash and swarm. We use, we're going to pick, let's see. That's, oh, these are all, these are atmospheric ones. We're going to go to, I think we're going to go to splash yeah we're gonna use splash so yeah you're gonna just click on it and then open a copy so here you, as you can see on the top right there is just showing like how the what the thing looks like and then just click open a copy um yeah so that's basically what's happening then just let it load for a little bit computer's slow if you want tell me in the comment section below if you want to know how to get motion 5 uh, yeah uh, now we are on the motion 5 page straight away we want to change the little 100% thing that says on the top line to 25 or 12 percent your choice or you can just click fit in your window now this is the layer section now we're going underneath down to timeline and the ones underneath all the layers underneath we're gonna click graphics then now what we're going to do now is we're going to go, you see the cog sign there that I just clicked on and that's the heads up display, the cog sign, the one next to that is the one that we want to click and then we want to click color, color correction then channel mixer and now basically the great thing and then now you have to click inspector uh, which is on the top line as well instead of, and now you have like a little nice drag and drop drag around paint tool sort of thing so you can change the color of the splash so as you see I've got it red at the moment but I think I'm gonna change that too so yeah you can do any colors you like remember you always have to click inspector to open this up using color correction channel mixer sorry about the the really weird like black thing that's coming there I don't know really know what's wrong with that but I'm just gonna change this to a yeah as you can see now it looks red looks quite cool but I'm gonna stick with a yellow for no apparent reason now, now what we're going to do is we're going to go click on background elements in one second. I just need to finish changing something. Now I click background elements, so now we're going to change the color of the background. Same thing, color correction, channel mixer, inspector, then change the color to any color you like. I think I'm going to put a turquoise color if I can find it. Uh, yeah, I'm going to use a turquoise color. Yeah, let me just see how I can do that. I really don't know what is wrong with that little thing, the black thing that keeps on popping up there, like uh, on the the actual window of where the viewing is. Yeah, so now I've changed it to a turquoise. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna run it through. It's very very laggy on my computer, but it runs much faster after you've uploaded it to YouTube and all that kind of thing. Then. Just gonna go through it very very slowly. It's a very good uh, application, I'd say. Motion Five and this intro is probably one of the better ones to use because you can change the colors. But you can change the colors anyway. Now we're gonna wait till the text pops up, and then it should. W then we'll do the next part of the task. Uh, I will be doing some more things on Final Cut. Just wait up because I'm still learning how to use the software a little bit. And if you want other things like app reviews, just tell me. But more, it's going to be more like how to make things and stuff on the computer. I might do maybe a little bit of pixel meter that I've learned here. So now uh, from the Unaplu, shout out to him. Alright, so now we're at the title here. You want to hit pause when you get to there. Then you want to just click on the T button 
and then click at the end like how you would do in Word if you wanted to delete a word so you're just going to click delete or so you click the text button the T and just delete all the title here and change it into whatever you, what you, you want it to be so I changed it to JSON apps which is basically the whole thing that's all it is it's quite simple quite quite simple um, yeah that's pretty much it I'm changing I'm gonna click on the heads-up display to change the font color um, as you can see I've changed it to J's apps yeah in the green and I can change like the centering all that kind of thing basically that's really it it's quite very very simple and you're making a professional intro for your um, YouTube channel and stuff so it's I would give it, it's a very simple one and if you have any problems just personal message me I uh, hope you enjoyed the tutorial cheers uh, remember also to subscribe check out my Twitter at schoolboy198 that's my Twitter name uh, Subscribe, favorite, comment if you have any problems, personal message me. Cheers.